What's up? This is the Band925, and I'm gonna show you how to. I'm gonna show you how to install your games from your Game Pass to Xbox One using your phone. Go download the Xbox Game Pass on your phone now, and then once you're done, come back to your Xbox One. So once you're done downloading, we go back to your Xbox One. So grab your controller, and then go home. So we're gonna go. Go to settings. So we're in settings now. Go to power and start up. startup. Sorry. Power mode and startup is what you want to click. You're going to want to switch to instant on. And once you're done with that, you go to system. Then you go to updates and downloads. And then it says allow remote installation. Click allow remote installations. So we're going to download a game from my phone now to see if it works. Or let's install a game and show you how it works. As you can see, there's no games in queue. So let's see a shooter. We want shooter. Um, let's try. Um, let's go home. Metro. Oh no. Most popular. Show all. Let's download. Pretty have these games. Let's see. We just want to show you if it works. Oh, let's see if we can do Batman. I think Batman's on here. Let's see recently added. Let's see these. I thought Batman was on here. Let's do the Walking Dead. We're here and we're going to install an Xbox and it should install. So it's in queue. Okay, we'll start it and then we'll see if it goes. So it says it's in queue. Let's check if we make sure you're in the game. There it goes. It's let's see. It's how it's supposed to fall. Let's see if our game is in. Yep, it's the Xbox One. Remember, you gotta change the default. And right there, it's right there about the download. The game that's gonna download before it. Um, episode 2 to 5. Let's see if we can check the playlist. It's in queue. And it, there it is, it's installing. So that's how you install from your Xbox Game Pass to your Xbox One. You have to enable it and then you have to enable it on your Xbox, on your Game Pass, on your phone. So remember you go to settings and you have to change the select default to your Xbox, the one you want to download it. It has to be on instant on to work. So if this helped you, please like and subscribe. I'll keep making more. Thanks for watching and hopefully this helps you. Later, peace out.